What's good guys, welcome back to Ron's Rise News, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another video where in 1984, Carroll Shelby wasn't tuning for Mustangs, he was deep into the performance scene at Dodge, breathing extra life into a wide range of vehicles. Arguably the best known or perhaps the most shocking Shelby product of the era was the Omni GLH, where GLH literally stood for goes like hell. Now it was a proper hot hatchback that garnered a cult following over the decades and now Dodge is honoring that legacy with the new Hornet GT GLH concept. Now obviously the concept draws directly from the new 2023 Dodge Hornet Compact Crossover which I just did the debut video on right before this one so make sure you check that out if you haven't seen the Hornet debut. And Dodge isn't pulling any punches in this segment either, coming out swinging with the blurbs about power and speed where normally you'd hear about practicality and price. Now the GT GLH concept goes a step further by showcasing what the speed loving Hornet buyers can do with upgraded parts sourced through Dodge Direct Connection. And the upgrades include a lower suspension that drops the Hornet an inch, giving it more a street focused stance and an unrestricted dual exhaust system with black chrome tips, which also brings some oral delight for the Hornet GT's turbocharged 2 liter engine. Now it rides on exclusive Direct Connection 20 inch painted wheels and it gets the special GLH graphics with black painted lower trim for a properly dark classic GLH look. Now the Hornet GT GLH concept showcases parts available after purchase, but could Dodge build such a thing from the factory? There's really no indication of that happening. And with 265 horses already available in the standard Hornet GT, it's not as if the small crossover is slow. Dodge lists it from 0 to 60 in 6.5 seconds in that entry level model. Now stepping up to the RT PHEV, well that brings an additional all wheel drive system and combined output of over 285 horsepower culminating in a 60 mile per hour sprint in 6.1 seconds. Furthermore, the Hornet RT PHEV can go over 30 miles on electric power alone and the new Dodge Hornet GT will reach dealer showrooms late this year. So with that said, what do you guys think about the new Dodge Hornet GT GLH concept? Let me know down in the comments below. And if you guys did enjoy the video today, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Giving the video a like will help get it up in the rankings, more people can see it, and we have a bigger discussion on the new Hornet GLH concept, paying homage to the 1980s. Now if you guys enjoy what I do here, make sure you check the links down in the description below, where I have a one-time link donation for my PayPal, my Cash App, my Venmo, and my Patreon, just in case you guys want to donate an extra dollar or two to the channel. I appreciate that extra love and support, guys. Thank you so much. You guys can also check out the Ron's Rise merch, where you can get long sleeve shirts, tank tops, stickers, hoodies, everything Ron's Rise is there. I'm also on TikTok, Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter. See everything I'm posting, car memes, pictures, and videos that doesn't always make it here to the channel. Also, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel, but click the notification bell so you don't miss one video. You guys also be blessed, have a great day, and we will talk to you guys in the next Ron's Rise News video. Peace.